House Senate dealt what appears to be a fatal blow to one of the president's top priorities, immigration reform. Well, President Bush had hoped immigration reform would be part of his legacy, but today those hopes were shattered. A grim President Bush today came before the cameras to bury the immigration reform bill, not to praise it. So the president didn't have a great deal of ability here to go out and twist arms. It was a far cry from the confidence he projected three weeks ago. I believe we can get it done. I'll see it to Bill signing. The lopsided vote indicates a serious loss of clout by the unpopular president. For the second time in three weeks, the Senate soundly defeated legislation that would have tightened border security and put many illegal immigrants on the road to citizenship. Status quo border security. At least 12 million illegal immigrants. An antiquated and broken immigration system. It's uh, extremely difficult for me to understand how the will of the American people want to continue to have broken borders. And that system will continue as is with no solution in sight and little desire on Capitol Hill to plunge yet again into that morass. That's exactly right, and the, as we mentioned before on this broadcast, there was something in this compromise edge legislation to offend everybody. A lot of Americans have lost faith in their government. The fact that the bill was unpopular with so many Americans. They're calling in such numbers that it's crashed the telephone system here in the Senate. My question to the Senate today is what part of no don't we understand? They don't think we can control our borders, that we can win a war, that we can issue passports. The Senate voted overwhelmingly against the measure, with most of the opposition coming from the president's own party. Jake, that seems counterintuitive to some people. Everybody, whether you were for this bill or against this bill, some, says something has to be done about immigration. And yet, you have a majority of the Senate saying, well, let's not do anything. There was something that everybody didn't like, and that ultimately is what killed the bill, especially with that very, very strong opposition from Republicans. with most of the opposition coming from the president's own party. Especially with that very, very strong opposition from Republicans. Especially with that very, very strong opposition from Republicans.